And we're back with another episode of Minecraft Hardcore Mode. And yes, last night, last night, last time we went to the Nether. We obtained loads of juicy things such as this Nether wart and this Blaze Rod. Yeah. So we are just going to sort some of that stuff out, but. The main um, objective for today's episode, I'm, I'm not digging this, to be honest. I've been thinking about it, and this bit here, this balcony is is not done right. It's no good. It's awful! Get it out! Uh, it's, uh, I don't know. I I know how to change it, and so that's what I'm going to spend today's episode doing. Uh, but yes, first let's sort out our never stuff. Also, I believe I need an axe to chop that set of trees down. I really don't want these trees to be here. As in, I'd rather the tree farmer somewhere else. But whatever, there's nowhere else for it to be at the moment. So, I guess we may as well put in our never water along with all this. Carrots are still not done, huh? Um, so, I can put it here, I guess. Um, or I could put it somewhere else completely, that's a good idea. Let's put it... Nah, I don't know. Uh, pointless decisions. I don't know what's behind here. How many torches do we have? We have six. I think that'll do. Yeah, let's do that. Let's put it round here. Just for the shits and giggles of it. So yeah, anyway, what stage are we at? Well, since we've gone and gotten our juicy blaze rod, we can make potions, and I'm going to put the potion stand down shortly. Um, but until then, um, what we we okay? I've, got, I've kind of run over what we need. I'm losing my words today. I apologise. Then again, I, I'm like that most days. So now the kind of potions I'm after for the ender dragon we need some health potions and that needs glistering melon which requires gold and it requires obviously melon so we're gonna have to get melon relatively soon but we did find that underground not underground I keep saying it. of course it's underground it's a mine shaft do we uh, we need to go and find oh, there's the end to find a abandoned mine shaft, that's how you say it. Um, right, how are we doing this? Do I make it one wider or not? <sighs> oh man, I'm so indecisive today. You know what? I will. Just because I can. Um, yeah, so I'm going to have to explore there relatively soon. That's literally the only reason I need to go to the um, abandoned mine shaft in the first place. And then, also, we're going to want regeneration potions. And for such things, we need a ghast here, so yeah. We're going to have to go back in the nether, and... Oh, hello. <laughs> what is this? I'm fairly... Oh, whatever, I'll just block it off and pretend it doesn't exist. So yeah, got to go to the nether again. And I need blaze rods, I need more of them at some point. Because you need blaze powder for what is it? Ender eyes. That's it. And for that, we need eyes of ender. But we'll get around to that. I haven't thought about how bad that's going to turn out to be. Um, so let's make ten upside here. Yeah, that'll do. And then um, also for potions, I'm going to want them to be splash potions, preferably. Um, or at least that would be nice. So, I kind of need gunpowder. Um, so, what I've been thinking of doing is making like a gunpowder farm. Not a gunpowder farm, just a general mob farm really, because there's no way I can get like a creeper farm to work. Uh, so, yeah, I'm thinking of eventually getting some hench mob farm going. Uh, because we're sorted for string, because we have the whole spider spawner, so I can just turn that on, as in, get rid of the torches, <laughs> if that's what I mean by turn it on. Oh right, so that's our never walk farm done for now. Right, so I can turn that on. Still not done, huh? And then, we can go and... 
Oh yeah, that that's the only res the only resource that like, gets burnt up by the thing. All right, I'm gonna want to sleep in a second. Also, I want to set up this blaze rod. I don't know where I want to put it. Do I want to put it in here? I don't, I don't think so. I'll put it underground. Nah. Also, I need to build an axe. And my axe. Uh, yeah, also, magma creams themselves would be quite useful. Because you get to use them for fire resistance potions. And that means if I fall into lava, I will not die instantly. And, you know, that's always a bonus in a game mode where you don't want to die. <laughs> it's generally very useful. Right, so, let's make this blaze rod. Where do I want to put it? I think it could go right here, just for now. So, here goes. I'm only going to use one of them so far. Uh, yeah! I was just wondering if I'd forgotten how to make it for some strange reason, but I have not. I made it! It's a bit lonely here. Of course, how much glass do I have? That's a good question. Uh, I don't have any, but I do have sand. Which I suppose I can use. So I'm going to want glass anyway. There's an achievement for making a potion. Uh, but the only potion I can make... I can make a fire resistance one, but I don't want to waste that yet. But what I can make... is a sugar one. Which is what I'm going to do. Uh, that is a potion of swiftness, I believe. Yeah, yeah. That's our food. <laughs> I had 45 stakes. How did I misplace such a thing? Right, let's make an axe. Because I kind of want to cut down all these trees. And then we can start on the building itself. Uh, right, we've got wood on us. <laughs> that sounds weird. So that's good. Um, okay, so I think it's axe. I don't know why. Oh no, you do need that. For some reason, I briefly forgot what you needed for an axe. Dur right, so I intend to make like the balcony. The balcony is kind of like enclosed in the house, but I want it open. So I'm going to have to like cut the roof back, which is annoying because I spent so long on the roof in the first place. But what can you do? Right, I'm not going to turn this all into wood just yet, as in wooden planks, because I might want these actual pieces of full wood. I am undecided on such things as of yet. Oh man, this is a really efficient way of farming as well. I just need to like put a ceiling cap on it in case we get one of those re renegade giant trees that we had before. Eh. Well, some of those end up really short. Yeah, we're set for wood here for a while. I say that, I'm going to run out really quickly. So, if I'm going to put like this mob farm down, it's going to be like a standard... Uh, what do you call it? It's when there's a room with like several um, canals, canals or like ditches in the room and all the mobs like fall down and then water picks them back up again and then they get cooked by lava. Uh, yeah, it sounds weird when I try to explain it, but it makes sense. Um, I'm about to run a pickaxe. Gosh darn it. I don't want to use my diamond one. So I guess I'll make another pickaxe. So yeah, I want to make one of those. I think it's like a mob... Is it a sizzler? Or, I, I have no idea. It might be. Whatever. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about. Uh, but yeah, that's going to take a while. So that will be... I'll, I imagine that will mostly be one video, but that's definitely something I have to speed up because I remember it took me hours when I first made one back in the days. Oh, and here's some solemn music. Right, actually, no. Let's put some stuff away and hopefully we have stairs around. Yeah, we do. Ah, oh, man. I really need to get better positioning for myself whilst I record because my arm just hurts so much when I do it. Right. I believe you have everything. Right, let's make that um, potion. Make all these glass bottles. Yeah. Oh wow, that's loads. We've got 15 of them. We don't need that many. We only need one. Alright. Well, this go under. This would go under utilities, wouldn't it? So we only need one. And thankfully, we have an infinite water pool. Man, these cocoa beans are useless. <laughs> I have not used them once since I planted them. 
Uh, and this is just to demonstrate how potions work for those of you that don't know, but I imagine most of you do. Oh, my never wart's grown just nicely. Up in here. To the potion brewing stand. And these need to be stairs. In fact, I could do that in a second, but meh. Right. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do... No, I don't need three. I could make three of these, but I have no interest in doing such things. Can I pick that up? Yeah, stick! Alright! Alright! Right, so... Actually, yeah, let's make these stairs now, because... Time we have time to kill. Where do I put them? I'll replace these as opposed to just putting the stairs on top of it. Yeah. The place still not exactly looking glamorous. It will look better, assuming I don't die, of course. I intend on like replacing with the sides of like I think wood will do for now, but I'm not sure. I'll work on that once I've finished my other things. Alright, so now I believe this gives an achievement. Should probably have checked. <laughs> Brew potion, yeah, there you go. Ooh, locate the end is soon on the list, and I still have to return to sender. Address unknown, no such number, no such zone, etc. That was the worst <laughs> pronunciation of that song ever. Um, oh god, that's gonna be ridiculous. And apparently for this uh, sniper jewel, you have to have been fired at by the skeleton in order for it to work. Which is why, previously, I was fairly sure that I'd achieved such a thing. But then it just didn't work. Oh man, you have to keep this active? Oh no, I paused the game, didn't I, going into achievements. Well, that was silly. That's just silly. Silly, yes. Idiotic, yes. We're nearly done. Come on. Come on. I want to be quick. Yeah, yeah. Now, I think redstone actually makes these potions longer, but I think glowstone... One of... I forget which does which. I'm not an expert on potions. You may have gathered this, um, but one makes them quicker, but more effective, and one makes them slightly less effective, but longer, a lot longer. Uh, glowstone does one, and redstone does the other, so I want to keep my glowstone around. Right, so let's change this. Let's get at this from below, lol. Oh, did I just say lol out loud? That's one of those things that... I, I do that with TY. Like, I started saying it ironically. But I say it ironically so much that it just ends up becoming a part of my vocabulary. And I hate it. <laughs> That's how they get you. People say these stupid phrases. And then you say things to take the piss out of them. And then you just end up saying it as regular speak. Oh, well. I usually, during, um, like, chats online and stuff, I usually reserve the phrase lol for when I actually am laughing out loud, because it makes no sense to say it otherwise. But usually when it does that, I usually say, like, genuine lol, just to, like, prove, in quotation marks, that I am actually, like, laughing at such a thing. Oh, I don't know if I want that. Like that. I don't think I do. Um, where's, where's my wood at? Oak wood. Right. This. Yeah, okay. That's much better. Um, and then obviously, I want to do the same here. No! Oh well. <laughs> uh, plonk. Yeah, okay. Um, that's roof. I'm so annoyed that I'm going to have to take down half of this roof. Right. That kind of sticks over the edge. I'll sort out when I get out there. For now, I'm going to have to take down... In fact, I'm going to have to take down most of this, to be fair. Man. But on the plus side, I get a lot of stairs out of it. <laughs> stairs that I had before and then used on it in the first place, so I don't think that really counts. Right. You see, I want this kind of, like, as a balcony area, as opposed to just being part of the house, which is what it was. I wasn't digging it, and look, well, from the inside it was okay, but looking at it from a distance, it looked like weird. It's like the house had a bizarre growth on it, and houses with groves on it are not cool, man. So, yeah, I might have to move this as well. This is a bit annoying. That's okay. Um, alright. Oh, man, I'm going to have to take down more of this on a fort. 
think I have to get back up on the roof again. On the roof again. Right. Or. Or. I could. Do it like this from both sides. I had not thought of that. Ooh. That's a. Oh, do I want to do that now? Oh, goodness. That means I have to change from there as well. No, I don't, I'd have to change. Oh, man. Decisions. Decisions, decisions. Um, if I'm going to do that, I want this to be bigger. Um, I have enough stairs on me. Oh, man. <laughs> first, first Minecraft world problems. Right. If I want to do it like this, I might want to make this ceiling a bit bigger. But then I'll go through all my stairs. Also, it's nearly night time. Just FYI, I'll just gravel to get up on the ceiling. And how am I going to do this? I don't know if I want it like I just had it, or if I want it. Because I think this looks kind of good, yeah. Because it's not like an extravagant like house, oh my god, it's just kind of like a small place. So, okay, I suppose we're going to have to take half this stuff down again. Damn it, but it's almost night time, so I'll use the bed first. Whenever it will let me do it. I don't trust that it will do it at the moment. Actually, it might do it now. Come on. Yeah, nailed it. <laughs> There's now a giant hole in my house. Don't you have a giant hole in your house? Where have you been? Right. Actually, I don't know why I took that wood down. See, I knew it was good to save it. Um, I want this here. Yeah, there's no way that chandelier's got to stay there. Um, yeah, so this is the gap. Uh, so, the stairs would go... Well, I've got stairs on the corners, right? So, it would go like this. And then go up to the middle from there. Yeah. Uh, hang on. Gravel time! Man, I'm not going to need a lot of that wood, actually. But I am planning on doing some of this balcony that involves changing it, so no can do, boss. Right, this whole area can stay the same. Pretty much. So actually, this isn't as bad as I first envisioned. Because of here, you can just do this. Yeah! Yeah! Spent so much more time on this building than I do any sort of real life. <laughs> oh man, any sort of real life room like appearances. My, I'm one of those people that tends to leave their room the same for ages. Well, most of the time. So yeah, actually, this didn't take long. Oh, did it? But yeah, I definitely have to change the position of that chandelier. There's no way. Oh right. You know, I think that I think that's it for the roof. It's got a kind of like lick here. Yeah, it's not bad. Um, so let's look at it from the side. And I think something needs to go on that leg because this just kind of looks strange being jutted out like that. Um, something needs to go there, but I'm not sure what. But yeah, it looks much, much better, and then having that and the back of it. And then the inside can be kind of like a quaint thing. Uh, but here's something else I was going to do. Okay, here's where I'm actually going to turn the wood into something else. Right, that might be enough, we'll see. So, where's the center? The center is right here. So, if I do this... This is a method to this, and then you can only get up through the sides, and then, ooh, naturally, do I want glass here now, or do I want it to be wood? We'll see how it looks with wood, and again, I need to, like, one of these days I'm going to have to travel to a winter biome, just so I can get different kinds of wood. 
Yeah, and then you have. You go, and, and now you're on the balcony. Um, something needs to go here. I don't think it needs to be solid wood. Unless. I do this. No, what am I thinking? <laughs> what am I doing? Yeah, I don't. That, that could work, hang on. If I. Do I want to put it at the same height? Or. Now, here's an idea. Do I do these kind of windows? Well, regardless, I'm going to need some glass. There's more glass where that came from. Downstairs. I need to make, like, this area. Like, I need, like, a trapdoor. There's so many things I need to do. Oh, but it's effort. Oh, man. I've run out of things to hold. Um, We don't need half slabs. And we don't need a fish. Why do we still have a fish in our inventory? Right. Glass. Now we can... Actually, I had glass panes already, didn't I? They're right here. And I think it was the exact number I wanted as well. Oh boy, what don't we need? We don't need 17 dirt. T no one needs 17 dirt. No one. Right. Back up we go. And we're going to see if this works. And if it doesn't, then I guess we've just lost four glass panes. Oh well. No, I don't like how it inks just suddenly gets incorporated into that. You know what? I don't think that would be good. We need windows of some kind. And obviously we need a door there. <laughs> this kind of goes without saying, really. Um, although that... Whatever. <laughs> Look, it's so small now. I could make this like kind of abstract. Actually, there. this could work. Let's see. I say could, because it might just fail horrifically. It's kind of like sort of a basement view. But not. It's kind of weird from here, but you're not really going to notice that. That's kind of cool. Actually, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> that'll do, man. That'll do. Uh, this floor needs to change. Oh. Or maybe it's at the edge and can't. I don't know. I need to put something here. Because the rest of the floor is not like this. But... I want to change the floor anyway, so you know what, I'll just leave it as that. And we'll sort that in a minute. And then finally, uh, this might actually be running a bit long, but there's one more thing I want to do. One of those things, actually, oh, there's two things I want to do. One of those things, build a workbench here. So after like all that effort, like putting one downstairs, I just end up moving it here anyway. Uh, no, you see, what I want to do is get fences, and that's what I'm going to use as my balcony posts. Uh, how many will this produce? Probably not a lot. <laughs> no. Nowhere near enough. Four. Four! Right, so maybe... That was six. I'd say we need about 18, so... That'll do. I would have thought so. So let's turn that into sticks. Now we have sticks for days. Right. 22. Yep, yeah, that should be enough. Oh man, this is coming along. Yeah, I still don't know about that. Oh, I need a door as well. <laughs> Pretty important. Right, yeah, and yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we got a door and we are out of inventory space again. We don't need one bone. So the door can go here, obviously. But I, I was thinking of making all this glass, so it still looked out on the side. You know what? Yeah, but then if I do that... No, you know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. It'll look better than the wood, I would have thought. The wood is just there literally because it was the first wood I came across. <laughs> Right, that might be enough. And I still want to save some of this glass, mind you. It's so indecisive. There's not much I have to put down anyway. So let's see how this looks. 
all glass. It's looking better like this, to be honest, than having small windows. As you can tell, I'm not someone that spends their time building much. But hopefully with practice, I'll get good. But this is supposed to be hardcore mode, so... Oh, that looks weird with that open now, though. That looks very strange. I'll leave that gone for now, so it can just be an exit. What I would have to do then, I suppose, is put glass uh, blocks down as opposed to panes. But, you know, that'll do for now. Oh man, sun's setting again. You know what, it's set too many times this episode. I'm just going to put this fence down. Cool to do. Um, I don't, know, don't need a Neverack. <laughs> At least Neverack's getting a use now of the coming update. Could turn into Neverbrook. Man, there's so many things for the new update that will be good as well. But we'll do with that when we come to it. Yeah, now we've got a proper actual balcony for the house. Whoop. Right, so I'll sort that out when I can be bothered, but... For now, this place looking a bit better than it was, I would have to say. Uh, so, next time, I suppose, I may either address downstairs and make that a bit better, or I could go and explore the abandoned mine shaft. Yeah, because I need some melon. I have a hankering for some melon. So, we'll find that out when we do. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Tools.